In today's video, I'm working on a 10 inch by 20 inch canvas and I'm going to do a purple dip technique. I have two shades of purple, a very light pink and some silver mixed up and I'm using white for my background. I have everything mixed with Sargent Art Gloss Medium and water. I had a request for these colors and so I'm going to try them out on a few different size canvases and see how it turns out. But I wanted to start off with doing a 10 by 20 inch and I'm going to run my flowers or my puddles right through the middle of my canvas. So I'm just starting out by putting a base coat of my white down and I'm just using my palette knife to smooth that out. Once I had my white coat down, I decided to use the light pink for the very middle. So I'm just running down the middle of the canvas in a slight zigzag pattern and I'm just starting to create my puddles of paint that I will eventually dip. Once I had the really light pink down, I used the um, lighter shade of purple and put a ring around the pink. And then I did the same with the dark purple. For the silver, I just kind of dripped that in in a few areas. I didn't want to do a full ring of silver. I just wanted it to accent the piece a little bit. Once I had my puddles formed, I just blew up one of my nitrile gloves and then I just gently hold both the fingers and the um, hand opening of the glove and just create a bubble and uh, push it right down into my puddle of colors. And I just prefer the way that the glove looks over a balloon, but if you don't have any gloves, you can definitely just blow up a balloon and dip that right into each of your puddles of paint. Overall, these are really pretty colors. I really like that pink in the middle for something different and then the um, darker shade of purple dried really, really beautifully and I really like that dark contrasting against the really light background. But let me know what you think of this one down in the comments below. Like I said, I'm going to try these on another canvas just to see um, what kind of different design I can get. If there are colors that you'd like to see in this dip technique, let me know. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button. I do post two videos a week right now and I will see you all in the next one. Thank you so much for watching today.